The Kaaba, the holiest site on earth for Muslims, was constructed at Almighty God's command by the Prophet Abraham and his son, the Prophet Ishmael. Peace be upon them both. God reveals that the station of the Prophet Abraham stands within the Kaaba, the first house built for people. In it are clear signs, the station of Abraham. All who enter it are safe. Hajj to the house is a duty owed to God by all mankind, those who can find a way to do it. But if anyone is unbeliever, God is rich beyond need of any being. God commanded the prophet Abraham to call people to come as pilgrims to the Kaaba. From that time on, believers have visited the Kaaba in vast numbers to perform their Hajj obligations. This is described in verses. Announce the Hajj to mankind. They will come to you on foot and on every sort of lean animal, coming by every distant road so that they can be present at what will profit them and invoke God's name on specific days over livestock He has provided for them. Eat of them and feed those who are poor and in need. In the Quran, God reveals that the Kaaba will have a most important impact on people. The expression, so that they can be present at what will profit them, in the verse makes this very clear. Ever since the time of the prophet Abraham, the Kaaba has been an important site visited by Muslims on the Hajj. But before the time of the Prophet Muhammad, the tribes living in Arabia had turned their backs on the monotheistic faith preached by the Prophet Abraham and the prophets who came after him. The Kaaba, built by the Prophet Abraham and dedicated to God, had become a center for pagan beliefs. When the Prophet Muhammad captured Mecca, the Kaaba was again cleansed of all idols and began being known as the House of God. From that time on, the Kaaba has continued as a sacred place of worship, circumambulated by millions of Muslims every year.